Hello and in this video, we are going to learn how to create an animated 12-part circle that appears one by one like this one. So first, we are going to learn how to divide a circle into 12 equal parts. And secondly, we are also going to learn how to animate it so that it appears one by one like this one. Okay, so let's get to it. Now first, let's begin by Control m to create a new slide. And I'm going to delete add title and add text. We don't need that. Actually, I'm going to delete the first slide so that it doesn't confuse you. Okay, so now we are ready to go. Okay, so first let's click on insert and insert chart. Chart, not circle. And I'll tell you why in a few seconds. So in chart, let's go and select pie. And I'm going to select the first option. Okay. Now, we have a pie. So first quarter and sales, forget that for now. All we need to worry about is the second columns where we put in our data. So just put one. You can put in any number you like, but make sure that the number is equal because basically we are going to divide the circle into equal parts. This is six equal parts for now. Let's add a few more. Okay, so this is 12. That's good. Let's close the chart. Now let's delete the sales and delete the quarter. We don't need that. Okay, so our circle is done and you can see that we have split the circle into 12 equal parts. And with this method, you can divide a circle into any equal parts that you like. So you can divide into 5, 7, 6, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, whatever you like. And you don't have to manually adjust them one by one. So this is very convenient. Okay, so next let's learn how to animate our circle. Let's go to animation. And there are a few animation options here. So I'm going to choose the first one, which is appear. And in the effect option, instead of choosing the default option, which is as one object, let's choose the second option, which is by category, because basically we want the circle to appear one by one. Okay, and it looks a bit fast, so let's change the duration. So, 0, 0, 2, 5. Okay, let's play. And voila, that looks good. Now, if you want to precisely control the timing of each slide, uh, for example, you are presenting and you just you want to manually control the appearance for each slide, then you just uh, click on slideshow. Show. Let me show you again. Click on slideshow. And then whenever you want a slice to appear, then uh, just hit any key. So one, two, three, four, five, so this way you can talk and talk and talk. And once you are finishing one point, then uh, hit on any button on the keyboard and the next slide will appear. Now, some of you might be wondering, yeah, it looks great. I really like it, but I don't like the color. Do we have any other options? Well, there is just click on the circle and this will activate the chart design dialogs and then click on change circle. So the default is colorful palette one, but you can change it to any color palette you want. Or you can also change it to a color scale like this. So this will, so the circle in that this case will appear from very dark to very light, or you can change it the other way around. So let's choose one that appears from light to dark okay now there you go but personally i still prefer the colorful way because i'm a colorful person so if i ha have to choose i would choose this kind of color palette and that's it in just a few clicks we have um divided a circle into 12 equal parts and then we animate the circle one by one without any messy or manual adjustment. So I hope you find the video useful. That's it for now. Happy learning and see you in the next video.